Ms. Atkins. Uh, Mr. Young. Thank you, Mr. Peters. And, um, you know, it's, it's uh, interesting uh, to hear some of the comments that I heard today in regards to, you know, the reason um, why we want to do another year for Mr. Peters uh, for presidency. Um, I don't think all of the reasons have been provided today. Um, that's that's uh, something for another discussion, I suppose. And I guess the fact that I'm going to speak out today probably will have some bearing on my status as a council president pro tem and possibly one of the, uh, you know, whatever leadership uh, opportunities I would have. But you know, that's what leadership is. You don't make decisions um, because of um, what the repercussions are personally. Sometimes you need to step out and step up, and that's what I'm willing to do. Um, I think that Mr. Peters has done, has done a, a very good job. Matter of fact, I was one of the persons that supported him when he first wanted to run for office. But that's really not the question here. Um, one of the questions that we should have about this should be uh, the question of process. Now, we haven't even talked about um, what the council president, either one of us, would like to do as council president. We haven't even talked about it. I don't think anybody has heard it. No one said, hey, this is what I'm going to focus on. This is what I'm going to do as a council president. This is what I'm going to advocate for. All that was done, well, clearly wasn't done here. So I'm not sure what was discussed. I'm not sure what was talked about. But I'll tell you one thing. I don't think anybody in this audience heard about it. And I think that that's the problem. We should never do that. Um, the question is, is you know, why? Why would we have um, a, a process that doesn't include a discussion on what should be done? And even though this seems like Custer's last stand, I'm going to tell you what I think should be done. Um, I think that this council should be respected for what it is. We have a number of individuals with a lot of different skills here on this council that I think have been put in the periphery. Um, and I think that they should have that opportunity to take leadership. There should not be a gang of five that runs the council. I also believe that there should be an advocacy role for this council. This council is it's, uh, one of the, the, the kind of the almost laughable arguments I've heard about this presidency is that, well, you need to have experience running a docket. Well, we, we're not electing a docket manager. If that is, the, I mean, of all the things that you would want your president to do, the docket would be one thing, but it would not definitely not be on the top five of my list. You want leadership at that position that's going to advocate for this council and not to be um, an adjunct to the administration. That's what this, this presidency should be about. And I would say to anybody else here on this council that um, you don't have to, uh, no, let, let me go to this. You know, one of the things that has bothered me a lot the last couple of years is that Ms. Fry has continually asked for information from the mayor's office. And in my mind, she's, she's been snubbed every single time. And that really upsets me. Uh, if I was a council president pro tem, um, if one of my colleagues was snubbed like that, there would be some issues. There would be some discussions that would happen. There would be some advocacy. I would not let that happen. Matter of fact, there will be some issues. Uh, that's when you start managing the docket. When you have someone on my count on your council that is not being respected enough and not respected when it comes to her, her, her questions, then you might have some problem getting your stuff on the docket, Mr. Mr. Mayor. Those are the types of things that you should do as a council president. Um, yeah, I, I would I would agree with some of the folks who come up here today to talk about leadership. Um, let, let me talk about leadership for a minute. But leadership is not about what position you have. I'm going to be a leader regardless if I'm the president of the council or the president pro tem. I'm going to step out and I will lead. I've done my homework and I'm ready to take that leadership. But um, we should prepare 
each and every one of these individuals who are going to be here in the future, we should prepare them for the next seven years that they're going to be here. That means including committee chairmanships, but also leadership and on the other committees that are outside of the city. Um, people like uh, Mr. Weso uh, should be on SANDAG. Uh, so should Mr. Faulkner, I believe. Uh, we should take leadership at the new individuals here, the newer individuals here should take leadership on MTS. These are the things that should happen. It should not be a give and take on, hey, you get this position, therefore you, you get to, you, you, get, you, you give us a vote for, for president of the council. I'm not for that. I don't, I don't support that. And so that's how I, I look at the situation. I'm not going to back down on this. Um, you know, I'll, I'll pay the price, but I won't back down. Oh, incidentally, I think that every single one of these individuals who, um, who, are, who are not going to be leaving the council should all be on the budget committee also. If I was the president of the council, they would all be on the budget committee because that's the budget they have to live with. They have to live with it next year. Therefore, should, they should be working on that council. I think there should be a discussion on this. Um, I don't think there has been. I think there has been a horse trading back and forth. It's uh, personally, I, you know, I'm, you know, I, I really, I'm, I'm appalled by it, and um, I won't support it. Um, even though I do think uh, Mr. Mr. Peters has done a, a wonderful job, I will not be supporting his nomination today. Not necessarily for me, but because I don't think that it's the right thing to do. Ms. Atkins. Thank you. Um, well, since we are having a discussion, I will 